in this problem, we're asked to find the remainder. Find the remainder. When we divide x to the fourth minus 2x squared plus 3x minus 2 by x squared plus x minus 2. Now, this we have to do long division. We can't use synthetic division because the coefficient, this is not a linear term, and the coefficient is still 1, but it's not a linear term. If we were dividing by x minus 2, then we could use synthetic division. Because we're dividing by x squared plus x minus 2, we can't use synthetic division in its current form. We'd have to do some tricks to find it. So we're going to divide long division. Notice that there's no x cubed term here, so we have to put the placeholder in for that. So we're going to use 0x cubed minus 2x squared plus 3x minus 2. We're going to divide this by x squared plus x minus 2. We're going to key on the front guy out here. We're going to ask ourselves what times x squared makes x to the fourth. That's going to be x squared. Multiply that times everything on the outside and get x to the fourth plus x cubed minus 2x squared. And when we subtract the x to the fourth cancel, we get 0x cubed minus x cubed makes negative x cubed. We get 0x squared because negative 2x squared minus negative 2x squared makes 0x squared. And then we're going to bring down the third term plus 3x. We have three terms out here. We want three terms out here. Ask ourselves what times x squared makes negative x cubed. That's going to be negative x. Multiply that times what's outside. Get negative x cubed minus x squared plus 2x and subtract all that. Cancels. 0x squared minus negative x squared makes positive x squared. 3x minus 2x makes positive x. We'll bring down the negative 2 and ask ourselves what times x squared makes x squared. That's 1. 1 times x squared. 1 times x. 1 times negative 2. When we subtract, we get the same thing. The remainder is 0. The remainder is 0.